The official iOS 6 jailbreak has finally been released in the form of Red Snow 9.15 Beta 1. This version will install Cydia without the use of an SSH program or any messing around with codes. This jailbreak is not for the iPhone 5, 4S, iPod Touch 5th generation or any iPad. This is still a semi-tethered jailbreak. For those of you that don't know what that means, what it means is that you can turn your device on and off normally, but every time you do so, Cydia, Safari, and your mail app will not work until you connect your device to a computer and boot tether it with Red Snow. This version of Red Snow includes a feature that automatically boot tethers your device when it recognizes it in DFU mode, and I'll be showing you that a little bit later. You need to download Red Snow 9.15 Beta 1, and you'll need to have your 6.0 firmware and there'll be links in the description so you can download Red Snow open up Red Snow Windows users right click go to properties go into compatibility and run this program compatible for Windows XP Service Pack 3 hit apply then OK open up Red Snow Go into Extras, select IPSW, search for your 6.1 IPSW, click OK, back, and jailbreak. I'm going to be using my iPhone 4 on this video, just in case you guys were wondering. So now, as you can see, you do have the option to install Cydia. So check Cydia, click next, and put your device into DFU mode.
So don't forget, this is a semi-tethered jailbreak, so you need to boot tether it still. And you will also need to boot tether it every time your device turns off. So go into, close down Red Snow, open it back up. Go into Extras, search for your 6.0 IPSW, click OK, tap Just Boot, and put your device back into DFU mode. And there is the option, the feature that I told you about earlier. All you have to do is click, check this one, auto boot, and every time your device turns off and you put it into DFU mode and connect it into Red Snow or open up Red Snow, it'll boot tether it automatically. Now, city is still not there, but it will show up right now. There it is. Open it up. And you can see it's working perfectly fine. just to show you that I am on iOS 6 and I did install Cydia with the new jailbreak without the use of SSH hopefully this video helped you please like and favorite it it does help me and I do appreciate it if you need help leave a comment and subscribe for more videos. Thanks.